What is good, what is good, what is good, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, and welcome to Stay Out of the House, a retro-style horror game, and since we are in the month of the spooks, we got Spider-Man out too, we are going to mess with this also English. That's it. Stay Out of the House. The video game is generally the first generation your copy produced on behalf of and with the approval of Vague Scenario LLC. There are violent and disturbing images in this game. And I love the old school VHS style games like this. I usually don't stream them, I'll just usually play them. But yeah, let's just get right into it. Part one, the night shift. Here we go. Go medium. Take the night shift. Yes. And part one, so puppet combo video. I believe it takes place in first person. What time are you getting out? Six? Want me to pick you up? Uh yeah. yeah, it's too far to walk. <laughs> As if I'll be conked out by then. Then why'd you offer it? Have fun. That was a terrible friend. Alright. So let's walk into our gas station. Yeah, it's one of these games. Power Drill Massacre. Hey, what's up, dude? Just in time. Hurry up. R2 is the interrupt. I've got a hot day tonight. <laughs> Bullshit. <laughs> you wish. Come on, I've got to go. Did you sweep the floor at least? Sorry, dude. I was too busy. Hey, Rick left the list of side works to do on your shift. Now I've got to get out of here. Oh yeah, one more thing. I can't find the keys anywhere. The bathrooms are locked up, so go behind the dumpster, I guess. Lovely. Hey, I'm just trying to be pragmatic. You should try it sometime. Nah, I'm good. I'm the protagonist in a horror game. I'm good. Oh no, Jeff, wake up. Don't worry, I'll get help. Factory room one. Interesting. Oh shit, all right. I died in that. That. So you got the key. Got all three keys. Lower levels. Factory room too. Hey, we're, we're killing it right now. So where is this other key at?
Oh my god. Alright. Okay, how do I get out of this? Game over. Alright. That was fun. Uh, games with these types of controls drive me crazy. Alright, I'll start my night at work. Can't show on plus for on for cuts with this. Cigarettes. Cigarettes, cigarettes. Can't leave the store. Alright. Camera system. Cool. It's a new refrigerator. Nothing. It's a refrigerator door that opens both ways. A little weird, but yeah. Back door is locked. I guess I'll sweep. Since that asshole did not. I don't want to go out to the refrigerator. I want to go back out to the store. It will sweep up the floor. That's exhilarating gameplay, isn't it, ladies and gentlemen? This is what you came here for, right? Street Sweeper Simulator. Or Store sleep, Sleeper Sweeper Simulation. What is the vision of that door right there? I'm almost done sweeping. Yeah, exhilarating gameplay. We'll go put the broom away. Put the broom away. All right. Go back out here. I can't drink on the job. Sodas, ice cream, too sweet for me, soda, maybe I'll have some later, they've been sitting all day, nothing interesting, oh, we got somebody coming in, there's a customer coming, yep, Hello. Hi, can you give me ten dollars on pump five? I sure Thanks. can, buddy. Right there. The pump five. Okay, we we got them all gassed up and out of here. We are 
the best. We are doing our job. We got a customer done. Put away the car accessories. Let's go put away the beer. We got hot dogs. I'm not making more. Can't leave the store. Nothing special. All right. I play another round of game of power drill. Actually, let me check the map. See if there's anything going on back here. Extra stock that has a major shelf, products, soda pop. Right. Can we get another customer, please? I see somebody coming in right now. Yeah, come buy some stuff. Or not. Oh. Hey guys, sorry the phone line. Uh, that is so. Hey guys, sorry for the phone line in the fix. You have to bear with me until the repair guy comes. Don't worry, I'm not expecting any emergencies. You do a better job of side work during your shift. I'm expecting this to be finished when I come by in the afternoon. Scoop the fourth, place items that weren't purchased back where they belong. Clean the bathrooms. Alright, so I swept. Where is the bathroom at? I remember he said the bathroom door was locked. Refrigerator, Raider. Refrigerator. Back door is locked. Mostly porn. There's the guy look like under here or something. Right. Sweep the floors. Place items that were purchased back where they belong. Clean the bathrooms. How do I clean the bathrooms? Oh shit. Uh, there's a customer coming. Alright, we got another customer coming. Hello, ma'am. How can I help you? Hi. Can I help you? Yeah. I just need some cigarettes. Okay. Which brand? Uh, Banshee Red with uh, filters. the bathroom? I can't open it. Well, that's weird. Good luck. Alright, made a sale. Alright. We now have dealt two customers.
Need another customer to come in, please. He said he couldn't find a key. I could jump up here for whatever reason. more do, do, do. I want to go outside like we get another customer in here or something that van again. Hello. Okay, bye. I'm going to power your mask some more. to the bathrooms. Oh no, Jeff, please go. Don't worry, I'll get help. Okay. Let's try it one more time. Back to room one. He came out of nowhere on that one. It's a quick death. I need one more key. Got he. Low levels. Do it the last time. Oh yeah, we've got past this one too. Nice, we're in the attic. Made it further than we did last time. He's fast. We got extra life on that one. Bet. I got you. No 
Yes, sir, you stay over there, my guy. There's nowhere else to go. I was shot. I can't leave the door. Oh, hello. Let me get behind the counter. There's somebody walking up. Hello. Uh, there's a customer coming. Oh, he's already in your face. Hi. You're here all alone. Yes. Ah, he's creepy. What are you doing, dude? You're fucking creepy as shit. What's up, bro? You gonna buy anything? Can I help you, dude? What are you doing, my guy? You buy something to get the fuck out. Make me very uncomfortable right now. Are you just gonna like linger? Actually, you bought a beer, it looks like. Weirdo. I think there was something like shiny. Is that the room? Very private. I don't know where the key is to clean the bathroom, the bathroom. Nothing I can do. So far, I've made like three sales. The weird dude just walked up off the street, bought a beer. A white van has come by twice. He came over here and just like stared at the camera. Yeah, truck in front of the camera. Uh, 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 uh. Get it? Yeah, mostly porn. You know, being a being a gas station attendant must be boring as shit. Rack of Eos. So what do I do now?
the fuck was that? Um, why is the back door open now? I do not like that, Sam. I am. I might as well get the room so I can sweep up the bathrooms. Nothing suspicious here at all. In the bathroom, don't worry about it. Alright. Nothing suspicious about this at all. I will clean the bathroom real quick. That is my job. Alright. I just got to chill down my back though. Alright, we're back inside. Oh shit! Yeah, that, that got me. Was not expecting that shit. I hate it. That one got me. Like I knew something was wrong, I just didn't expect it to have to come out like that. Ooh. I had a chill too, I said it. I had a chill down my back. Now listen to God. Some televangelists just going off in the background. That's God's truck. I'm going to pee. I'll be back. Okay, Brendan. What the hell? Oh, was I drugged? How long have I been out? Brendan? How is he not back yet? Yes. This is a rest stop. Brendan, are you in here? So there's Brandon's driver's license. The aesthetic of this makes it even more terrifying. All right. I do not like it. 
Do you not like it? Oh, actually, I love it, but the vibe is killing me right now. A cornfield maze. Um, guess we will walk around here. A suitcase. It seems like someone lost this. All right. Very astute. So it's the grain factory, yeah? It's a bit graining on my nerves. Got a little semi truck. Okay, that's the walk faster button. Remember when all games used to look like this? And like not for nostalgia's sake, but because that was the technology we had. What is that? Oh, it's a dog. Hello, puppy. Hi. Hi, boy. Puppers. Where did you come from? Are you lost? Hey, we got the puppies following me now. Hi. Hello. Like, I heard it very faintly at first. At the beginning of the upcoming month, all work and productions conducted at Crawford Mill will cease to continue. Due to the lack of business over the past year, the owners unfortunately cannot afford to keep the mill open and running. Therefore, it will be condemned and sold to the state, where they will either repurpose the building or demolish it. Furthermore, the owner is has been diagnosed with stomach cancer, likely due to radiation exposure. Himself and his wife were moving away from Cedarville in hopes to find a better treatment center closer to the city. We send his deepest apologies to all employees who have dedicated their time and efforts toward the betterment of the company. You may gather all belongings within the last week of production, otherwise they will be thrown out of the building and gets cleared before being condemned. Thank you all. Where'd the puppies go? Puppers? Puppy! Okay. Good boy. Alright. Let's go to where you came from and just get scared shitless again. Because you came from over here. Anything over here? Puppers is still following me, so I'm gonna take that as a good sign. Somebody else's briefcase or suitcase luggage. Why would somebody drop their luggage? Right, let's go this way. Old broke down car. Dead end. Okay, so we cannot go this way. Unless you're speaking about a metal fork with dead end, which you're not. Puppy just throws me. Yep. They got my dog, I'm happy. Let's see what's over here. Yeah, speed run techniques. Private property, no trespassing. Alright, so we can't go that way. Alright. So 
So now that we came this way, we saw a bag and two dead ends. We'll go the other way. These games get you because they're so like grainy, like old VHS tapes. And yes, you know it's a horror game. So you're like, yes, I know I'm going to get scared eventually. I just didn't expect guys to come walking out like, hey, bitch. So that's the middle cast, so let's go this way. The environment is just creepy as shit, too. So. Is that where I was? I cannot walk through that. Okay, that's the factory. So we came out here, we walked that way, couldn't go nowhere, we walked this way. Is there another path I'm missing, possibly? Nope, not there. Nothing there. Can't go over that fence. All right, let's go back to the mill, I guess then. Maybe there's something I missed. That wind noise is really well done, too. Our luggage. Okay, something about just walking on little corn mages that are unnerving. Oh, no, that's the bathroom again. Puppy is still following me. Can we go this way? It's super interesting because it tells you nothing. How's the rest of here? So we were driving this way, I will assume. There's an invisible wall here, so I can't go anywhere there. Found Brandon's ID out back of the um, bathroom. All right, invisible wall there. Cannot go through any of this. Okay. So the rest area is our play zone. This is all we can access right now. Hmm. 
We saw Brandon's ID outside. Back in here, back around, good boy, we came out, we came out here. And that's where we found the ID. Found the ID, we walked out here. And we walked, you walked, you walked. And we ended up here at the mill where there was a luggage. I did not see any doors that we could enter unless I missed one, which is always a possibility. The puppers is following me around. And it's dry, is this baby? Oh, excuse me. So nothing here I can interact with or open. We had a note about radiation. To add the clothes and plant. That was just so. Yep. Alright, so we get that. Go over here. Then we ended up. The puppers is right here. Where you met the puppy. We had that dead end signed over here. <sighs> Here we go. Creepy ass atmosphere. Um, I do have to get going here in just a bit, so I'll be ending this gameplay really soon. Like a crouch I can go through under here? <laughs> yeah, you're good, puppers. So let me check one more thing before I gotta go. Because I'm interested. But I don't want to be just running around the same area for hour long videos. Which right now I am running around the same area. Oh! Oh, poor Pupper is in the car. I did not see this. Okay, found the corn maze. Alright. This adds a whole new, um, aspect, kind of. Wish I would have found it the first time, but I wasn't looking. Ew. Is that a church? 
to our members of Cedarville Assembly of God. This letter is to form all the parishioners at the Cedarville Assembly of God of some unfortunate need, sudden and upcoming changes to our standard curriculum. Being said with a heavy heart, our family of religious followers have turned elsewhere. There are few who still attend our service, while the rest have sought out the opposing teachings nearby. However, the sanctuary they've found straight further from the Bible and from our God than I'd originally thought. In fact, they are not following the Bible. It is understanding that their syllabus is full of nonsensical gibberish. I don't know who or what they are worshipping, but the friends and colleagues of mine have started to treat me as a stranger, as if they cannot converse with me due to their new beliefs. I have dealt with threatening letters over the past few weeks, as well as an attempt of arsons on our beloved church. Last night, while eating with my family, a bullet was fired through my kitchen window while I barely missed my head. It truly obliterated one of my favorite paintings, given to me by one of our choir members. The treatment and threats and things I cannot take lightly, so therefore, after collecting my belongings at the church, I'll be leaving town in search of a new place of worship. I do not wish to leave, but fear as I have no choice. And I advise anyone who still comes to our church to join me towards a new place of hope and prosperity. Thank you all for your kindness and understanding during this time. Father and Pastor James Kindling. All right. So I will continue this story. I'm interested now that I've found my way to the maze. We see a factory that shut down radiation. A new church group has moved into town. The puppers is sniffing something over here. What do you got, puppers? All right, so we're going to end this right here. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe, and ring that bell so you know more for simple black content drops. And um, I'll see you soon. Bye bye for now.